All right, good morning. How's everybody doing? Welcome back to the channel. I'm George Loffrey. This is my channel. Somebody's crazy because, you know, we got a Christmas movie coming up. Everybody, everybody has to watch this thing on Christmas so it gets wore out. Glad I got it digital. I can just re-digitize it after, after it. But we got Elf. Yeah, Will Ferrell's Elf. Will Ferrell stars as an Elf. So anyway, this story is set in uh, 1973 where uh, Santa Claus ends up mistakenly pick up a baby from an orphanage and they called it Buddy. So he ends up making it back to the North Pole and surprising everybody when they when they doing a, a pep talk and Buddy surprises Christmas so a human is first time is raised at the North Pole, which turned out to be a pretty good, pretty good idea. So, after we're trying to figure out how to do all the jobs there at the North Pole, he uh, he ends up figuring, getting told that he's uh, a human being, and his daddy lives in New York City. Wow, 2003. DNS. Yeah, then then so he walks out. He, he, he figures out how to get out and floats across the ocean to a candy cane forest and then from the candy cane forest uh, he goes and, and uh, figures out how to walk all the way into New York City and then he starts doing weird things in the city which are funny well Farrell was not very funny but what he was doing was funny and Papa Elf you know he kind of encouraged him to do whatever he wanted to do Encouraged him to work all crazy and yeah, I don't remember the name of oh Bob Newhart that was Papa Elf. Anyway, so they um, he ends up going and, and finding uh, finding his dad in New York City at the Empire State Building. So he crawls up there and Daddy's writing children's books and he's mean and ugly and. All kinds of friendly stuff. So it turns out to be a, a family coming together, good times, Christmas time movie. So he ends up down the street at, at another retailer, working there to do Santa stuff. And Santa Claus is coming to town. Well, because it is Christmas in New York City. In 2003, you know, Elf has got to do some Santa Claus work decorate and do all that fun stuff set up Legos and all the crazy stuff that they do it turned out to be a pretty good uh, little funny story and that daddy after a while he gets arrested Santa Claus breaks down in the park and he has to help fix because Papa Elf showed him how to fix Santa's sleigh because you know he was there learning how to do stuff do I have any time left? No, I have plenty of time left. So anyway, Santa Claus's sleigh breaks down, the motor gets, and then they start singing Christmas carols to give Santa Claus more power to get off the ground and fly. And, you know, the sucker works on uh, emotions or Christmas spirit, whichever way you want to call it. Day walks into... Uh-huh. Okay. The... Uh, this this turned out to be a fun, uh, fun, 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 fun thing, and then apparently Daddy already had a had another young boy, and so he's got a half brother there, and you know Will Ferrell was acting like a, a teenager when he's not really. I think he was forty when he did this. He was a full grown adult making stupid kids movies, well movies like this. So anyway, they, they just, at the park, they distract everybody. Santa Claus gets away. The Mounties try to, the Central Park Police try to catch him. And Santa's sleigh starts working. They lose the motor. And then all the Papa Smurf, they go visit once a year for Papa Smurf and the kids and all that fun stuff. And is this thing even working yet? No, i got to figure out why that's not working. Computers having problems. You know how it goes. My FUD buttons aren't working, so I didn't use them this time around. But yeah, this this movie turned out to be pretty good. So we've got Will Will Smith or Will Farrell 
as the star in this movie. It came out in 2003. November 2003. It has 97 minutes long. It was a United States movie. It was English. They spent $33 million on it. And it made at the box office $228.9 million, $28 million. So it did a pretty good job. This was not a Disney movie. This was New Line Cinema. Uh, distributed this movie. So they did a pretty good job with this movie and I definitely recommend you go watch it if you haven't watched it a thousand times. And, you know, it's one of those movies that you should go watch, but, you know, once you watch it, everybody around you is going to want to watch it again. So if you're going to buy it, make sure you have a bunch of copies because they're going to wear it out. It's that silly and stupid and it's a Christmas movie and all the kids like it. Anyway, bye now.